Hi, Edie Ho, everyone. My name's Mr. Fruit, and welcome to the Guild of Dungeoneering. Now, as you all might know, I just finished my most recent Let's Play, Tube Tycoon. So, in today's video, what we're going to be doing is exploring a new game and possibly gauging your guys' interest to see if you want to see a series or just make this a one-off video. Now, depending on how this does in future videos, I'm going to be doing quite a bit of this, experimenting with some uh, rather various games, and there'll probably be some one-offs. There might be some series in there. Who knows? They could be gems, could be trash, who really knows. This personally really appealed to me, so I am excited to show you all the game. Some of you might know it, but it's not really that popular, so we're going to find out. Anyway, let's go ahead into slot one and head into the game. Now, I haven't personally played it. I've only seen some gameplay and stuff of it, but I know how it works. And apparently it's... Of oh, yep. all across the land. They're cheering, oh, to be a dungeon. Chasing fame and glory. Oh. The Ivory League of Explorers, the noblest, most virtuous guild in the land. Pfft, those insufferable jerks. Wait, what? I, I tried to go to the beat of the music. It doesn't work. I'll show them. They won't think me so grossly incompetent when I have my own guild. I bought a small hall in the bad part of the town with the gold I borrowed from them. I've staked out a dungeon that's ripe for the picking. I've even found a chump who can do all the dirty work while I sit back and watch the coins roll in. Like my father always told me, there's always someone stupider than yourself. Well, he never really said it to me. <laughs> well, okay. Some de self-deprecating humor. Love it. Actually, he said it to everyone but me. Hey, wait a minute. Let's continue. Dum -de -do -do. Hey, welcome to your guild. This is our guild. Now, I really like the whole art style and everything. We need to hire some dungeoneers, so let's build a barracks. Take my barracks card. And where do we want the barracks? Let's put the barracks right here. A new dungeon arrived, Akash. The one that's always left behind. The solitary lump. The pawn whose fun our father grind. Mm. I know. The sorry little chump. But first, try going on an adventure. Let's go exploring. Now, I think, let's see here. I believe this narrator, yeah, they call him Bard. So apparently he's going to chime in quite a bit during the game. We'll see. I don't know how how much we'll, we'll listen to him. I'm... I've, I am known to not pay attention and accidentally talk through stuff, but it appears we have some new place to explore. Let's go ahead. Quest one. Squeak, squeak. Everyone's got to start somewhere. Let's enter the dungeon with Akash. Let's do it. Rats, how original. I agree. Now, if you're confused, like, what in the world is this game? Well, I am happy to show you. Why is this so loud? Hold up. I'll play your first turn. It's easy. Okay, so he, he placed down a dungeon for us and he put some rubber ducky... And some coin. This looks like a bit like a gold coin. It Well, it is. Okay, defeat three monsters. So this turn, it looks like it's going to simulate for us. Even though I already know how to play. Um, so, oh, now, am I playing now? Okay, so let me show you the premise of the entire game. So you go through each generated dungeon. And the goal is to get to the end and defeat whatever boss it is. But to do that, you have to go through the dungeon. Which is generally filled with other creatures and whatnot. Now you actually want to place creatures and fight them because it allows you to level up in the dungeon so that you're stronger to be able to take on the boss. If you just tried to sneak your way through, you'd probably lose to the boss. So the way the combat works is it's like almost like a card game, I'd say. You have a deck and as you level up and get loot, you get more cards in your deck through this dungeon. Once you leave this dungeon, all your progress you've made is gone. And when you go into the ne next dungeon, you start fresh. But you want to get strong in said dungeon. So we're against the rubber ducky. This is our health. We have five, five little hearts. He has four hearts. Now this is the card he's going to be using. As you can, as it says, he will do one physical damage to us, but he's also going to lose a heart. Not the best attack. Now we have a few things we can do. This will block one of any damage. It's the the red and blue, I believe that means it'll block a physical or magic damage. Same here, and this will just do one physical damage. So, this is probably going to be an easy fight. We could block this and make him lose a health, but I think we'll just make this pretty easy and go ahead and do damage to him. So, you saw right there, he lost some health. Okay, so this one <laughs> is a stupidity card. So, he, he does nothing. So, we're just going to punch him in the face with eyes closed punch. Whoops. Now he's gonna do, ooh, okay, so he's doing two damage. Gonna lose a heart though. So let's block one damage and he'll kill himself. And we go successful. <laughs> Choose your loot. Now this is where the loot part comes in. So we won, we're gonna level up, which gives us another heart, but we also get to choose loot. 
So you want to look at loot. Okay, so this is an offhand, and your character can hold four things I'll show you. You can have an offhand, a weapon, a headpiece, and, uh, yeah, what is it, clothing or something? I'm not sure. But anyway, if we take this, that card will be added to our deck. So we will get Repel, which blocks three physical damage. We could get Kuppa, which does two magic damage, or a Twig, which is, gives us Bash, one physical damage, and blocks one physical. So that's tempting. So is this. I sort of like Fire Blast. So let's just use it as an example. So see, it gets put in our offhand, and here you see we can have a head, a weapon, and a body. And that's pretty much it. Huzzah! So now it's our turn. We get to control what we want to do. So... Okay, the goal of this dungeon is to just to defeat two more monsters, I guess. And I guess that's the end of the dungeon. So now it's our turn. So we have a little hand here, and we can play it however we want. So I could, for instance, put a room right here, and it connects all that. I could put a room right there, and it's telling us to go this way. And then I can also place some people if I wanted to. So I could put a nasty rat or a giant bat, but let's see here. This one's going to take us to the nasty rat. Now, this giant bat only has four health, so I'm thinking he's an easy target. And then he sort of auto-moves to whatever... He either prioritizes, like, loot or the easiest monster. So he's going to go ahead and fight the giant bat, who is going to do one physical damage, and then there's another mechanic added, which is unblockable. So he's going to do one damage, but despite our efforts, we won't be able to block it. So instead, we just do a lucky hit and whoosh, 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 hit him for two. There we go. Now, I think what we might want to do... Then we can go turbo mode. And that... Uh, no, wait, maybe not turbo mode, but battle icon animations. There's something in here to where we, we can skip those and it'll be a little faster. So this is going to do one magic damage and one, wait, per damage dealt. How does that work? I don't know. But what I am going to do is I'm just going to kill him. That's what, I don't really have to think about it. I'm just going to do two, wait, whoa. Oh, and he, he, oh, okay. So... That makes sense. So he's pretty much dealing one damage and healing one damage. But if I block it, he can't. So let's block it. So we don't get no health. Now, he's going to block one physical and do one magic. So instead, we have to block because our damage isn't going to do anything. And now he wants to bite, which is unblockable. But an eyes closed punch will take down the giant bat. And we leveled up here. So now we can choose to either take some gold or get some loot. Now it looks like this place is pretty easy, but I think we'll take another loot just in case. Because if we took some gold, we could actually then put it in a room and possibly get some more. But whatever, we could get bash. We get just one health. Or we already have that equipped. We could sell it for one gold. I'm thinking we go. Let's go straight jacket, sure. Yes! <laughs> I've got to contain you, Akash. You're dangerous. Wait, what is it? What did that guy just say? I don't know. All right, we got to pick a uh, play up to three more cards this turn. So it looks like he's going to fight the nasty rat. We have seven health. We're level two. I don't think we're struggling. We got a fire blast. I'm thinking we just go ahead. Technically, I guess I could do a giant bat, but whatever. We'll, we'll fight a rat. Let's just end the turn. Let's do it. This way looks so... Wow! Oh no! The nasty rat attacks! Dum pa da da. <laughs> like I'm just holding my little coffee mug with my straight jacket. Okay. If successful, I discard a card. Uh, I can't block it, so unfortunately it is gonna be successful, but I get to do two damage to him. So because he discarded my next hand, only gives us two, which is okay, we still have something to play. That was unblockable, so we didn't have a choice. He's gonna do another one damage unblockable. Well. Oh shoot! Oh, I didn't realize. Oh, discard is permanent. Well. That sucks. Okay, well, this isn't going to do anything because it can't block it. I swear, if we lose here, nah, we're fine. We're fine. Uh, we could block it or we just do, yeah, let's just do one damage. I mean, he's going to have one heart. We got three. He's now shuffling. He's using, oh, okay, there we go. Lucky hit. We'll finish the job. Dum 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 dum. Way to go, Akash. Woo, victory. Hurrah, hurrah, victory. That was so quick you made it look easy. Another happy tale in our short story, if not a little bit violent, and not for the queasy. <laughs> Wait, what? 
Oh, I can already tell I'm going to like this game. Pow! Piece of cake. Walk in the park. Hardly broke a sweat. So easy, in fact, that your dungeoneer can't possibly expect to be paid. Can they? Take that loot for guild funds. Make them earn their dinner. So, oh, okay. So it looks like the more we explore the map, though, we get more gold. Obviously, monster kills give us some gold. Loot and gear sold give us some gold. And the quest bonus. Giving us 61 gold. Ooh, gained a new battle scar. Flesh wound. Wait, what? Why would I want that? Hold up. It gives me minus one health? What? <laughs> Tis but a flesh wound. Well, that sucks. That doesn't seem like much of a bonus to me. Seems like a sad bonus. Okay, now we can do a few things with our guild. Now, the whole point is to explore dungeons and get more gold to expand our guild, and I will show you here. So, we have different tiers, and each of these adds on to our dungeon, or, yeah, and then it will add on to our guild. So for instance, we have Hidden Den. If we wanted to do this, it would unlock a cat burglar. This would unlock a trickster favor, a bruiser, warrior spirit, all this sorts of stuff. Um, we can get like a, what is it, was that a hug in a battle? <laughs> we get Mime, Apprentice, four uncommon items. Oh, interesting. I, bruiser sounds pretty cool to me. So let's get a bruiser. Let's build this guild, the training yard. Where do you want to put the training yard? Let's put the training yard right there. Huzzah, Emsayu! Not Welcome. Not a gentle kind of dungeoneer, nor a poet, or a muser, but one that fills the heart with fear. I give to you the bruiser. Ooh, it's going to do that every time I expand my guild. I feel so special. All right, let's go exploring. Now, it looks like we still only have this place to go. Oh, but now we have quest to Rat Pack. Defeat the Rat King. Oh, into the dungeon. Defeat the Rat King, I shall. <laughs> now playing Vanquish. Okay, so what do we have here? Squeak. Okay, so, oh, there is the Rat King. Okay, so yeah, this dungeon, defeat Rat King, will do. Now... We got to get over here. So how do we do that? We start building some rooms. Now we especially want to level up because uh, he's got seven health. Oh, yeah, he's a big boy. He he don't mess around. So let's let's figure out where we want to build and how we want to build this. Let's go corridor here and build a mysterious fountain here. And I think what I'm actually going to do, they have five health. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. What was this thing? Monster gains conceal next fight. What? I don't understand. Hold on. I wanted to fight somebody. I want to fight this giant bat. Okay, we're going to see what this does. I don't know if this is a bad thing, but huzzah, fight me. Okay, I wanted to fight this guy because he's a little easier to defeat and we want to level up faster. So he's going to regain health. Oh, wait, no, that's magic damage. I was going to say that's perfect, but not in this case. And we can't block it either. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, oi! Do one physical damage and... Oh! Oh, no, we're fine. Okay, he didn't heal up. I don't know how that worked. He's doing it again, though. And we can't do anything about it again. So, how do you like this? And technically no damage. Another unblockable. Okay, this is... Uh, if we lose to a giant bat, I'm gonna be- wait. Oh, he has five? Oh, no, he gained- oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. This is not going well. Block one, what the fudge? Okay, I'm gonna block this magic damage. Uh, screw you. Wait, 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 what's this? Oh, I have a trait? When you fully block an attack, deal one damage. Woo! Oh, that is handy. What's a loner? Minus one heart if in a dead end. Oh. Okay, that, that is cool. Okay, so ah, well, that's unblockable. Who oh my, if we die. I swear to the Lord above. Okay, Lord, okay. What? Oh, man. Okay. No, we... We can block that. All right. Oh, yeah, and then Spikey's going to kill him, right? <laughs> oh, my gosh. That was a, the fiercest bat I've ever fought. Goodness gracious. Okay. We can get plus one health, we can get another cuppa, or we can get a wooden, whoa, block three physical damage, but I feel like that's a little over, overkill right now. Sort of like in cuppa or stray jacket. Uh, what do you guys think? I'm going to go, let's go straight jacket. 
Let's get that extra health earlier. I feel like that's pretty, pretty helpful. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, what? Hold on, so that, that monster hand card thing went to us. But where did, oh, fountains. Monster gains conceal next fight. What? Okay, I, I still don't understand what that means, but I think we're fine. I think we're okay. So we have a few rat man we could fight. They have six health. Okay, they are scared. They, well, okay. I don't really want to fight those people. Let's see. We need something to connect all of these. That would be helpful. And in the meantime, I guess I can put a corridor only there. Yeah, apparently I can only put it there. I don't really want to do that, but uh, whatever. Okay, I, I put it there. And then this room can... Really, that's it? All right, well, screw it. I guess we'll just uh, put it there. And I... Okay, these guys have five health. Yeah, we're just gonna fight those guys. Those guys don't seem so daunting. What's this? There's nothing here in the... Oh, whoa, what in the world is that language? <laughs> That's... Wait. Wait, what? Why don't you keep going? Okay, whatever. Oh, this is good. We like this. Let's do... Oh, another mysterious fountain? Could be magical. Let's place it here, and let's see what this one says. Oh, okay. Fountain of Stupidity? Hero gains stupidity to next fight. Oh, I don't want that. Okay, we are not going in there. What we are going to do is we're going to put silver coins here so that if we beat him, we get some extra gold. And then put a room here, I guess. Having that! All right, fight me, you rat beast! Play battle card face down. Oh, no! Wait, 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 wait! I didn't... Oh, my gosh. Oh, I did not... Wow. Okay, this is gonna be fun, isn't it? I... He could he could be doing... We're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna go unblockable. Okay, so he just did physical damage. That's okay. Let's go... Let's block two physical. And it's unblockable. Okay, bad start, bad start. This is not easy. Okay, that's that's good. That's a fair trade. Let's see what he does. It's unblockable. <laughs> um... Oi! Okay. Oh, no, no, no. If successful, enemy discard. Oh, Jesus. Okay, come on. Come on. Block it. If Unblockable. Okay. Just one more damage. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Block it. Block it. Yes! Okay, Spiky will kill him. Goodness gracious. Oh, I'm so dumb. Okay, so... I think I already have an offhand, right? No, I have a body. So... We get that, but that would replace whatever we have. The Ooh, that's, that's pretty nice. Or... Ah, oh, see, so this is sort of... We get some decent cards, but we also get a stupidity card. Huh. I'm thinking... We try the paper crown. Yes, a crown fit for a king. Look at me. And we got some extra gold. Chitter, chitter. What you want? Ooh, a gold pouch? Okay. Okay, I don't I don't know if we can take on all these gnolls. How much health do I have? I only have seven. I'm not going that way, though. Okay, good. We're going... Oh, but... A nasty rat. Oh, we could get a corridor. No, we... Currently, we have no way of connecting ourselves here. That is a bit of a problem, isn't it? No, that's not... It's not what we wanted. Okay, whatever. I guess we have to fight Ratman. Well, I guess if we're gonna... Hmm, what does this, what does this say? Wait, wait, wait. What? It told me something. It said something about attacks or... Will, will you just tell me what this guy does? Screw it. No, we're gonna fight a null here. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. Send me that! I don't know if we can defeat a null, but we're about to find out. Fury. All physical attacks deal plus one damage if on half health or less. Oh, yee. Okay, so he's gonna do two damage, but lose it. Okay, so I think that's... That's our best bet. We, we block a damage, deal damage, and he's gonna lose on with headbutt. Yeah, there we go, okay. We're up on that trade. If successful, enemy discards. Gosh dang it! I can't not do it! Ah, child lord. Alright, well, we lost a card. Not ideal. Alright, so he's gonna lose a heart. But he's gonna do it. Oh, no, he's doing double damage now? Oh, no! Okay. Oh, wait, wait, this should block it, though. No, but he's still doing two damage. Okay, well, block one of them, I guess. So it'll negate it, and he loses one. And we just... got two damage. Oh, lord. Alright, we just have to hit him once. Alright, and finally... He does- Okay, block the two damage and spike you will kill him. I'm not even scared. Okay, we finally leveled up, which gives us one more health. Now we are ready- 
Oh, so this gives us two health, but we get two stupidity cards. I already have a, a, a head, right? And I already have a body, so I'm, this looks like about our only... Ooh! Oh, those are pretty good, actually. All right, well, I'm gonna... <laughs> don't mind if I do slip that into my offhand. Okay, and we got the gold pouch. So next up, another gold pouch. Let's put that right there. Another mysterious fountain. No, thank you. Oh, here we go. All right, so here's a way to connect to the boss. So that's good. Now, do I want to add a null here? I don't know. How about we figure that out after this turn, if I want to fight another dude? We might be strong enough after defeating this guy to fight the rat boss, but we will find out. Okay, so that's unblockable. Well, I guess we just... That's the only one that'll do anything here. So, smack him in the face! How do you like this? Now we can, ooh, deal one damage, block one, and with Spiky, that's gonna do another one, so two damage. Okay, we're not gonna let that be successful, so I'm actually gonna heal and do a damage. Ready? Ooh! I am liking you, Imsayu! Okay, so that does, oh! Okay, we, we won right here! Easy! Look at us! Oh my god, we are more than ready for the Rat King. Oh, wait a minute, okay, so... We, I guess we can take some gold, because currently these... We already have all of these. Um, you gain one on next magic tax draw card. Oh. Oh, so I lose here. Oh, if I do this, I lose a heart. Hmm. Already equipped, sell for two gold. Is this better than what we currently have? Um, no, I don't think so. So how about we, how about we just uh, take some gold? Yeah, let's do that. So I think oh, okay. So then we have to place it in the next room. So we can either fight a dude or just go ahead and fight the Rat King himself. Let's fight one more guy. Well, he oh he has eight health. Wait a minute, is he growing in power too? I don't remember having him eight health. Three, four, five, six, seven. We're still a little higher than him, but maybe we'll uh, we'll fight someone just to be safe. Let's fight a Rat Man. And put a gold pouch in there. And in the turn. <laughs> Go, Imsayu. Do me proud, soldier. All right, that's unbreakable. Uh, so let's do... Ooh, I'm like it's smite. Two free damage. I don't mind if I do. Uh, he's going to lose a heart. Oh, easy. All right, we do two damage here because of the block and the heart health. Yeah, the spiky's so good. Okay, let's do just an oi. Oops. And then lastly, I guess we do one magic damage draw card. Uh, it doesn't really matter, I suppose. Let's just hit him in the face. There we go. Victory is ours. We didn't level up, huh? I wonder if level three is the max or just takes more to hit level four. I don't know. Oh, a, a weapon. We don't have one of these yet. Okay, so we can get bash and rekindle one magic damage, one health, one physical damage. Hmm. Get uh, a slice and a shift. Uh, which one seems better? I certainly like that uh, heart gain. Let's try the club. Sure, let's bash him in. All right, well, we're full on gear. Look at that. I am looking good. I'm looking a massive gym. Um, yes, please. All right, let's put that in with the ranking. If we win, all oh, the spurs of war will be ours. All right, fight me. Give us that massive gem. Exactly. We need that. Now, don't you let me down, I'm sorry. Oh, my gosh. Wait, four, five, six. Seven. Oh, wait. Are we, we are matched. Okay, well. Oh, oh, that's perfect. Okay, there's that card. Let's go ahead and gain a heart here. So we only lost one, technically, and he, he still lost one. He's going to do two damage and lose one. Let's block one and deal one. Shaboom! All right, we're already doing well. Uh, we don't have much here, so just... Uh, Oi! Oh, Oh, he's already... D oh, look at us. Oh, G freaking G Rat King. <gasps> Get wrecked. Level up plus one HP. Doesn't matter since we're going. Hey, pow. G Piece of for your lucrative plundering. After all your aimless blundering. How you rode your luck without getting stuck. Left me and your enemies. Wondering. No. Oh. Ooh, I was gonna say pondering. Well played. What wordplay? Pow, piece of cake, walk in the park, blah, 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 blah. Okay, 15 gold for map export, 23 for monster kill, 13 for the loot and gear sold quest bonus, 101 total gold. Holy cow, bonuses. A luxurious lo lounge adorned with the fruits at your labor, a fire lord, 
victimless crime, goblins. Start with armor plus one. Whoa, that's pretty sick. Okay, let's return to the guild and see what we have gathered. Okay, the trophy life. Oh, the trophy. Oh yeah, let's put a trophy room. Let's, we can't attach it there. Let's do it right up there. Oh, what is this? Caught up in all this doom and gloom of all the places you've wrecked. It's nice to have a big trophy room. A place to quietly reflect. Okay, nice, nice. We got a trophy. Now we get to add two new things, I believe, because these all cost 50. Yes. Okay, so what do we want? We can unlock four uncommon items. Oh, okay. So then I think these would be a potential for us to loot when we're in the dungeons. I believe that's what that is. Those all look pretty cool. I like that. Let's let's build a woodworker. Let's put the woodworker right there. Okay, great. And let's expand the guild yet again. We haven't gotten anything in this one. Uh, Crone's Knowledge. What is this? Plus one starting hand size in battle for first two fights. Well, that's pretty good. Uh, oh, this is uh, another person. Plus one heart for first two fights. I don't think I need... Wait, click for details. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Combat cards. Oh. Okay, so this this will sort of tell us what we're looking at here. Apprentice. Ooh. That looks pretty dope. Traits talented. Start with fire one. What is that? Uh, I don't know. Hold on, so then what did the what did the mime have? What was their trait? Click for details. Traits. Oh, you don't have any traits. Well, oh, what if his trait is he copies other traits? Well, that would make sense since he's a mime, but I don't know if that's how it works. Wait. Plus one to first physical damage in battle for first two fights. See, those are cool, but seems like overkill right now. I don't think I need those yet. Plus one loot choice slot after first two fights. Get a cat burglar. What is your trait? Bonus treasure cards. Tempting, but I'm liking my warrior right now. I don't think we need that. Ah, uh, what is this? I sort of like this. This will let us get better loot earlier on, so let's build that. Let's go ahead and... Oh, so it's not a room. Okay, I just get it by default. Okay, and then I'm assuming we can go exploring. What's this? There's more, a whole world to explore. Why, there's gold to be found and treasure in store. But what's the point you're all hit and miss? It's so plain to see. You're not cut out for this. Uh, that's rude, dude. At least he loves to rhyme. I can, I can appreciate that. My employees did return with some interesting rumors from the Rat King, though. There was mention of a magic orb, an orb of noise, noisiness. It's exactly the kind of thing I could use to keep an eye on the Ivory League. I'll need all the help I can get if I'm going to take them down a peg. The rumors point to make dungeons. I'm the grass and the for a What am I saying? I'm seven out. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, continue. Okay. Oh. So now we've got a lot of options, and we can decide where we want to fight. Okay, so I think I will leave it at that. And from here, it is up to you guys. Would you like to see some more Guild of Dungeoneering? Would you like me to see maybe a few more videos? Maybe a full-blown Let's Play? I don't know how far we could go with this, but I think there's fun to it. And from what I'm told, though, it gets very unforgiving. So we may start exponentially sucking. Like, I've heard it, it babies you a little bit here. This is proper boring. Hey, shut your face, dude. All right, I don't want to hear from you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Could be a one-off, blah, blah, blah. Sound off in the comments with what you guys would like to see. From here on out, a lot of these series and videos are going to be up to you guys. So if you want to see some more, comment, like, show your support, and have a fantastic day. I'll talk to you in the next one. Farewell. Farewell.